the door again. Forgot about it. doesn't want to be next to me. <laughs> Hello, Jan. Hello, everybody. Oh, that's right. Nobody's there. How are you all doing today? We're going to be working on the journey animation a little bit further. Turn down that music. There we go. To a respectable sound. Something backgroundish. There we go. Bouncy Bear, hello. Hello. Oh, so this week. Yep, it's all on the journey animation, and I think we made a good progress yesterday. We got through an entire session that uh, hadn't even been thought up until the previous day, and um, just went straight on through. It did really good. Three hours worth of work? Darn, darn good. What did we, what? Just what? What did we do yesterday? Let me give a quick look here. So yes, oh, I can't do that. Ah. Yesterday we did this small scene where the camera comes on over to this section and the dragon is starting to figure out how the Minecraft alphabet works. And then we started the setup for the next scene where he's gonna be helping out with the portal. There we go. What are you writing? All right, and so this is going to be the uh, Huggles the Giggly Penguin. <laughs> Hello, the penguin. Good to see you guys here. Lovely to see you guys here. 
Mm. Do, 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 do. Good. So, now he needs to be helping out with the portal. And spoiler note, there isn't going to be anything accomplished in this, but it is going to be noted in, in this animation that the dragon knows what's going on and how to help out. So, we've got to fill out how much time left until it's the happy section. So, I'm thinking that these next few sections should be almost montage, almost a little bit more montage-like. Like, there's one scene here, and then there's another scene here, and another scene here, and another scene here. And then we finally come to the final scene before everything switches over. Uh, I'll be working most of the stream. Uh, <laughs> it's good, good, good that you're working on your homework. Thank you for the support, Dino. Lurks always help. Lurks always help. Hello, Bob. Hey, Bob. Mm hmm. You have been scammed. <laughs> All right. So I'm thinking that we should have some of these be montage-like. So this scene, scene will be pretty short. So Angel is going to turn back to the portal, um, shake his head, and then turn back to the dragon. And then um, the um, he's, dragon's going to act something out. And then it'll switch into the next scene again. So, scene, little time, scene, little time, scene, little time. So that way it's um, a little bit easier. Do, 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 do. Oh. Let's get away from our, from our starting position. This should be the, the working position here. So that way you guys can see a little bit more of what's going on. All right. I think let's get in this guy's movement here first. So Angel's got to look at the dragon and then, uh, well, look at what the dragon's drawing on the ground and then look at the portal and then shake his head. So something's not still not working right with the portal. But uh, they are starting to make some progress with it, but it's still not uh, quite what they need. So let's see here. All right, right about here. Let's do a little bit more. All right, and then turn back to the portal. You gotta turn your whole body, your whole body in the other direction. Do do do. Do do. <laughs> Got more of those El Diablos. Oh, come on, Akila, you can lay down. Uh, the Akila, Akila decided to sort of join me on the floor. I accident. He was underneath a blanket, and I almost stepped on him. But because I almost stepped on him while he had the blanket on him, uh, it kind of put a little pressure onto the blanket, which kind of freaked him out. So he's not he's not too wanting to be near me right now. Not so much. He's just like, you nearly stepped on me. Poor doggo. Poor doggo. Mm, lean up. 
up like this. And then head up there. And then let's turn this knee as well. <laughs> Gives a pop up a little bit of treats. Now, apparently, Akila is the only one that wanted to be with me right now. I saw Akila. Hey, she wants some Charles. Here, she wants some Charles. She should come up to the. She come up to the couch. Yeah, why don't you come up to the couch? You can have some Charles. There you go. I know you're all excited to have Charles. Wait, what's happening? What is happening? Hello? Dog is invisible. Why is dog it? What is going on? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Why does why is that possible? Well, apparently we're not going to see puppos. But you can hear puppos uh eating. Nom nom. Good boy. Hmm. Hey, Silver Lichen. How you doing? Nice to see you. Can't see Puppos. Oh well. Just know that Puppos is right up here. Nothing much. Working on a long project. Long, long project. And we're just about to the halfway point, I believe. Um... 14 days of streaming this, um, only two days a week. <laughs> Did someone say combat alley? Yes. Uh, yes. Oh, oh, hey, I'm going to do an outfit change. I'm going to do an outfit change really quickly. Uh... I'm gonna do one for myself. Uh, combat Ellie. That outfit is not looking too hot right now. You need something that looks prettier. Outfit, outfit change. Puka, Puka. Hey, since you know, you know, Silver Lichen is here, maybe you should put on something that you know, a little kind of a little of reference to them. Okay, how about that? You okay? Well, okay, yeah, we can do that. Okay, well, we took it, we, we got a copy of it. We didn't, we didn't take it. You said took. I'm pretty sure you guys stole it. No, we didn't steal it. I swear we didn't steal it. <laughs> you stole it. Yeah, we stole it. <laughs> Fine, okay, get behind the shush bush and let's, let's put on the, the outfit. You know, I do have my own outfit. Why didn't you guys go to my wardrobe and pick one up? Oh... Well, you know, we just were clipped the horses, you know? <laughs> Where is Combat Puka? Here we go. Combat Puka. There we go. Put on this there. There we go. All right. This is this is my own outfit. You can go take back the other outfit to Ellie. I'm pretty sure he wants that. <laughs> go back to the other camera. Camera one. Dook. There we go. <laughs> I thought it was cute. So, got ourselves Angel turning. So let's go ahead and get those arms moving in the right direction instead of having El Al Elbow. El Diablo. These elbows that are pointing in definitely not the right direction. Bad elbows. There we go. Get that rotated in the right direction there. And this guy needs to move down to here. Not so quickly there, hand. You need to follow the proper rules there. Do, 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 do. And you need to have your chalk out before the turn. Good, there we go. So now we can turn properly. Good. Turning properly. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Ah. 
Thank you, Silver. Ah, <laughs> uh, you and Owl, I just absolutely love your drawings, both of you. Oh, that's right. Owl's, mm, Owl's already gone to sleep. <sighs> Owl's already gone to sleep. But, oh my gosh. Yeah, I love both of your guys' drawings. Ooh, that's right. I can do a thing, can't I? I can do a thing. Hold on. Shout out at Silver like in studio. Ooh. So, I can do this thing, can't I? Shout out. <laughs> Shout out. Oh my gosh. Like they have a Twitch thing and everything. <laughs> I don't care. Uh, oh, that's right. In the previous scene, I completely forgot. I need to change some of the expressions on, on these guys, don't I? Oh no, I forgot to change the expressions on the faces. We need to go back. We have to go back. Guys, we've got to go back. All right, I need to change. Let's get this guy blinking. So we've... Camera zooms on over here. Then Dragon's drawing something. Let's get a couple blinks in. Do, do, do. So this one, this one need to keyframe. Oh, 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 that's right. I got, I got, I got blinks already ready. Blink animation already ready, ready. Perfect. Okay. Let's duplicate those blinks again. Ooh. Uh, eyes. There's the eyes. Good. Give me those eyes. Because you need to have curiosity in your eyes a little bit. In order to show that, you need to have the eyes moving around just a tad. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. I'm Sorry, Jen. Sorry, Jen. I just got excited and I'm like, oh, I have commands. Oh, by the way, I do have um, a doohickey, um, a doohickey command now. Screen keys. Screen keys, right. Screen keys. <laughs> Screen keys. So you guys know what I'm doing in case you want to learn something. Um, I just got so excited. I, I just like doing some commands. It feels, it does, at some at some level, it does feel weird to say, hey mods, can you do this for me? Thank you very much, appreciate it. It, it almost feels like I'm ordering you around and it feels weird. To be honest, it feels weird. <laughs> I should, I should, I should do that more often though, though. All right, so flick over to this point. Nah, let's flick over to here. There. Okay, right there. And then let's bring it back to this point. Okay, good. Good, and then we want to change it to this position here. Oh, 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 nope, nope. Okay, we want to actually bring the curiosity up to... My bad. We want to bring the curiosity up to Angel here really quickly. It's just like you notice Angel and then you turn your head. You have to notice, notice and then turn. So it's just like, oh, you're there, and then bring up your head. So. Right. And as you bring up your head, the eyes need to change back to their normal position. So to here, let's have the forward, bring it down. There we go. Mm actually no let's keep on doing that left a little bit and then 
hold and then rate a little bit, even as it fades out. I want to make sure that I get a little bit of curiosity in those eyes. There we go. And let's add in another blink. Duplicate, bring in the blink. There we go. And bring in the last blink here. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Ah, uh, yeah. I, I think I'm probably going to get to that point too soon. Mm. <laughs> oh, right, 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 right. Do that. I need to do save. Okay. Alright, so now this scene looks a little better. Angel puts stuff into the compost pile. And then Angel looks over here like, what is happening? You're understanding letters. The dragon is understanding a language. Oh! He might be helpful with figuring out how the portal works. <laughs> uh. Ooh. All right, so now we're at the portal, and Angel... Uh, let's get some more letterings on here. Maybe if I copy over the text. Oh, wait, what's this text? Hold on, hold on. Where's... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, this needs to go into the wrong folder. Gotta keep make sure I keep everything organized here. Um, Day 4 Dragon. I think that's right, yeah? Yes, perfect, good. That's the right dragon. That's the right dragon. Need to fish in the pond and lightning in the... Feeding fish scene. Yes. Yes, I do need to put some f lightning in there. Uh, let me do altering between yours and stresses streams. <laughs> Wait, is stress streaming right now? Uh, she's streaming kind of early, isn't she? Or is this normal, her normal time and I'm just uh, not aware of it? Because I'm usually at, at my job... I'll be stocking them yogurts. Yeah, let's go back to uh, that before I forget about it. Because it should be an easy scene to fix. Thank you, Jen. Let's go back to that scene. Uh, where is that scene? So this is the anger scene. Uh, baby egg hatches. Uh, Angel picks up baby dragon. And then... Mm, goes off to this scene. Let's bring on the weather really quickly. Um, oh no, that's the wrong weather. Right, 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 right. I need sky. Clouds, sky, weather animation. Here we go. Weather, animation, and clouds. Alright, so... Things quickly progress. And then here. All right, what is the lighting that I have in this area? Let's bring in the skies and everything. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't have any lights happening right now. I don't have any lights happening right now. Ooh. This might be a little bit more difficult than I thought. Head out to bed. It's getting late for me. Uh, expect uh, some art tomorrow. Woo! Have a wonderful stream, Puka, and I wish you luck. Thank you. Take care, Silver. Yeah. So right now, I basically have a single light right now on everything. Just an absolutely single light and apparently the water is super reflected did you see that yeah look at that it is reflecting 
a fake sun up there as crisp as possible. Wow, look at that. Okay, how does one fix that? No, I don't want atmospheric filter. Uh, maybe that was a poor decision. It's possibly a poor decision. All right. Let's grab um, material. No. I want water. Where is the water? Water still. Here we go. Water still. This needs to become a little bit more uh, diffused, I guess. Um, shading. How does the shader go? Oh, good lord. Do, 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 do. There is a principled B BSDF here. But where is it located? Shadered, transparent, shadered mix. Ah, here we go. Principled BSDF. Here we go. This is what we want. Let's turn down that specular a little bit. Uh, roughness. There we go. That's what we want. A little bit more roughness of that of that sun helps out. So it's not quite as crisp. It's not like a mirror. Mirror? Okay. So the sun works fine for... Let's see here. This scene right here. That scene... All of these scenes. So let's do this. Let's call this midday sun. Let's call that a midday sun. And then I want to. Um, actually, no. That's not what I want. We'll just call this main sun. Main sun. So I can't actually switch in between two different suns, but what I can do is change the strength of the main sun. Okay, so anger. Okay, here is where the sun needs to change up a bit. So let's put a keyframe in for the strength and... <laughs> I'm a Thank you very much, Ikith. You are a support to so many of us. Thank you very much, Ikith. So many of us, I mean like Jen and Thomas. Thank you very much for being a support to everyone. Do, 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 do. All right, and this needs to fall in intensity, I believe. Do 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 ba da do 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 da do da ba da do do. Okay, so let's bring this down a bit. And actually, let's uh, this needs to have a different color from this point here. So let's have a key on the color there and change the color here. So we're going to go into the more blue spectrum here. There we go. To represent nighttime. Because the best color to represent nighttime is a blue color. So that way you don't have to go pitch black with everything. It's just like, you know, got to work with some fake lighting. Oh, goodness, I'm thirsty. All right, so... Oh, good. Good, 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 good. So it starts off from here. All right, so I already had something set up for that. Good. All right, good, 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 good. I thought I had something set up. Okay, so now let's go ahead and add in some fake lightning. What I'm thinking I'm going to do is just some very simple lightning things. 
which is taking the sun and turning it into a lightning bolt. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12, 12 frames I think will do well enough. And we want to bring the saturation down to zero and light up to that. And let's bring the intensity up to this. Okay, there. And then this one duplicate, bring right on over here. So now, bam, bam. Okay, good. So we don't need the lightning strikes or to see the lightning right there through that hole. What we do need to see is the effects of the lightning at least. Just so that you know it's stormy. Okay. There we go. Good, 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 good. All right. So now we at least got some lightning in there. Just the effects of the lightning. And I do need to bring down that flicker a little bit less because it doesn't... The flicker almost looks like lightning, but uh, yeah, I'm going to have to at least ease down on how much flicker there is and how intense it is. But I do still want it to flicker a little bit. <laughs> do, 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 do. Don't switch. Um, uh, e. do, do. Oh, good. And I even uh, brought the sun back to its other point right there. Um, what is the sky doing, however? I don't know what this is doing. Okay. I do need to change up the world. Oh! Alpen Glow Up. Hey, thank you very much for the raid. Thank you very much. <laughs> Appreciate that very much. Hello, Raiders. We're just working on some animation right now. Long animation. About halfway through it right now. Mm, halfway through? Eh, actually, no. Mm, not so much on the halfway. Yeah, maybe not halfway. Shout out. But we're working on it. <laughs> oh, so what are you guys? What were you guys doing over on your raid? What was uh, happening? Were you guys playing, working on anything fun, delightful? Let's see here. Let's take a look at this whole scenario through really quickly here. Because something's happening with the sky right now. Speedrun attempts. That's awesome. Good, good. Thank you for the follow there, Cinnamon Monkey. Cinnamon Monkey. Mm. Speedrun attempts. Did you have a couple good attempts at least? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Do you have any good attempts? Thank you very much, Wiggly Fox, again, for the support of a bunch of us. Thank you very much, Wiggly Fox. Love seeing you two around. <laughs> I'm getting better. Ah. <laughs> Hmm. 
do 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 Bap the bug. Bap. Dragon baps the bug. I think that's the cutest point right there. When the dragon's just attacking a teeny little bug. That's where we're at right now. Whoop, that didn't work. No, there we go. And that's currently where we're at. The sky, however, has done something funky. What are you doing, sky? Hello, sky. I want you to change back to the way you were. Uh, objects, world. Oh, 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 that's right. I do have a skybox, don't I? Uh, skybox. Here it is. You are changing layout. You are changing, and I don't know. Okay, so you're changing from this to that, and from that, you do not change, and you need to change back. Where are you at? Object transformation, material. Material is what we want to change. Let's bring back that music. All right, so for that scene, goes blue, stays that way, and it needs to change here. Do, 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 do. Duplicate, bring right on over here. And take this guy and duplicate it, and we need it to change back. We need it to change instantaneously from one scene to the next. There we go. So now it should be dark blue there and the scene should be good. Better blue, better blue sky. I like that. Much better. Now this scene down the road should look a little bit better. There, it doesn't have a weird blue sky. Dark blue sky like it's part night, part not. It's got a solar eclipse, that's what's happening. <laughs> It's 3, 35 a.m. I must uh, head out to bed. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Alpen Glow Up. Um, you're actually about an hour time zone away from me. <laughs> Here in the Mercas. Mercas. Uh, off in Flatland, Ohio is where I'm at. Flatland, Ohio. The highest point in the regional area. I kid you not. The highest point, landmass. And it's not a mountain. It's not even a hill. It's an overpass. Not kidding. <laughs> oh, it's just like, do you got any mountains? Nope. You got any hills? Nope. What do you got? Farmland and fields and an overpass for a highway. <laughs> uh, uh, oh yeah, yeah. I'm I'm up late because this is my normal time for work. I'm a I'm a nighttime grocery stalker is what I am. Nighttime grocery stalker. So this is my normal time of being awake. I'm normally this awake. Woo! Yeah, I'm usually up stocking them yogurt. Milking it for all it's worth. Ah, cheesy puns. Because it's all my area is. Got to watch out for that cheese. It's kind of sharp. All right, so he needs to look in this direction a little bit. Um, do, 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 do. Hold that position for a little while, and his head should rotate around looking at these symbols a little bit and then look down okay 
Yeah, there we go. Good. But this body is not moving the way I want it to. Let's move you up. <laughs> yeah, okay, there, 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 there. There we go. That's something better. <laughs> you can go right ahead. Most of what I have is free. <laughs> you can steal my jokes anytime. These cheesy puns stink. Uh, oh, they're a the little curdled. Oh, oh. They might be all... Not only are they a little curdled, but if you hold them up, they're kind of limp. They're kind of limp burger. <laughs> And if you ever get the chance to uh, smell Limburger cheese, um, don't. Don't. <laughs> uh, really? Your soul hurts because of them? Do they? Oh, it's, but to me, these jokes come out really easy. Really easy. Breezy. Ah, oh, breezy. <laughs> Breezy. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're just gonna get fed up with it, though. <laughs> I swear, I'm in the cheese department. And I know all of them. I know all of them. <laughs> uh... uh Backed up. Oh, oh man. Uh, I didn't. I didn't see that one mm, coming, but it mm, came in through my uh, window like a, like a brick. <laughs> yeah. I'll string that along. <laughs> uh, uh, can cannon bear them and cannon bear them any longer? Uh, well, some of them are good, huh? <laughs> no, only some of them are good, huh? Uh. Okay, now he needs to turn around and, and uh, say no to the dragon. All right, so let's go ahead and just take these keyframes, I think, from here. Uh, yeah, from right here, let's go ahead and duplicate these keyframes, and that should be a good speed. Yeah. All right. And I think... Oh! Jiminy Christmas! Oh, it's Wiggly Fox. Oh! Gah. Oh, oi! I don't think anybody did that last stream. Oh, goodness sakes! Oh, my arm feels numb. Oh, oh gosh, my arms feel numb. What? Oh, that was weird. Do that again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you very much for the 50 biddies. <laughs> I no, I'm fine. Don't worry. For some reason, I just I just flailed them outward. They didn't hit anything. They didn't hit anything. Just from I guess flailing, they felt kind of weird and tingly. Oh, hate. As something's gone wrong with the uh, the video cam capture device, it's only showing one frame, and that was a while ago. Mm. Don't know why, but you get to hear the puppy has the churros. You want some Charles? Want some Charles? There you go, you have some Charles. Nom, nom, nom. You should go pop, pop. I only have Aquila with me today. The loud one. I know. These dog treats are good. They're really good. Mmm. Mmm. All right. So now he needs to tell the dragon, no, it's not working. So let's go ahead and... 
Right. Let's put in very few of these frames then, shall we? I don't think we need too many. We don't need to go crazy with the no. We don't need to shake it back forth so much that... He gets dizzy when he says no. Right there. Okay, so... <laughs> well, apparently we've got to take care of a few things. Let's get rid of the sky and clouds. Um, let's get take care of the background. Let's take care of the farm building. And let's put it on to... Bang, bang this one right here uh what about here Ooh, wow that that didn't help at all goodness sakes what what is going on what is going on mm. mr cheese joke breathe leave oh I can't be believe he's still going on. <laughs> I got, okay, I got it, I got it. That one did, in fact, breeze over my head. I, I, yep, it did. It went, it went straight on over. It's straight over my head. Oh! <laughs> Puka, pants check, are you wearing them? Good, carry on. <laughs> All right, what's happening here? Why is why is this head not shaking? Am I not am I not am I not doing this enough? All right, let's bring this all the way here. Yeah, something something's wrong here. Okay, something's wrong here, and I need to figure out what. Because I want him to do his shake no while he's turning over the dragon. Like, no. Maybe I do need to have a bit more jitter to this. So let's, let's give this a try. What if I increase, double up the key frames here to go through here? So these key frames don't change anything at all for the turning of the head. But what they do is lock the turn. So as he turns, he can do a different type of action. So let's go ahead and bring the head backwards a little bit. And then on the next in-between, we can do another turn back. And then we can do another. All right, let's see how that works. Perfect, okay, good. All right, so that should give me, um, all right, that gives me what I need for that. And these arms now need to move along with him. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, actually, let's bring those arms down. And we need to have those arms down in kind of a defeated manner. Yeah, okay. Now we can bring them back to their original positions. Let's go ahead and do that. Duplicate this keyframe, bring it right on over here. Mm. Mm, duplicate this guy, bring him on over here. There we go. All right, good. That has a little bit of a shake to it. Oh no, actually, Owl! You're awake! You're awake! You just mi missed, uh, you just missed Silver Lichen. They were here. Ah, oh, oh man. Yeah, Silver Lichen was here for a little while. That's why I decided to put on the uh, combat puka outfit. <laughs> do, 
do 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 do. But um, Nightbot mentioned uh, something beyond the saving. Uh, what is it? Over in the muted general on our Discord server that we have, there is... What is it? <laughs> Me and Sochi's were going through a few of my older videos, and oh my gosh, I did not realize what horrible jokes there were in that one. What was it mentioned here? It's just like, what's important is he doesn't have pants. Puka, 2015. <laughs> it's like, what's important is he doesn't have pants. He needs pants. <laughs> oh, goodness. Well, what, what was I thinking back then? That was a weirder video. That was a really weird video. Mm. Let's give it a quick go Saber Rooney to that. Mm. Uh, oh. Home is where you, the pants are off. <laughs> Wait a minute. Then does that mean right now I'm not at home? Oh no. <laughs> oh goodness. I'm not at home, everybody. I don't think I'm going to be for a little while. <laughs> do 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 all right so we got the turnaround we got the shaking of the head no no nothing's nothing's working out we got to get some text in here so let's go ahead go to the other dragon actors actors blue dragons and we want this dragon and we want to duplicate this text so let's go ahead and do do exactly that let's duplicate let go of that and then shift s and we want curse selection to cursor bam the text is right there love it and let's move this into blue dragon day five and we can move this writing into this position now, too. Mm. Right there. Good. Um, how do we want to do this? Uh, maybe we should bring the angle of the camera up a bit. I don't think the angle of the camera is going to work out well. So let's go ahead and do that. Mm. There we go. Now we can see a little bit more of the writing. I think that's going to help out. There we go. Let's duplicate this. Oh, wait, wait. I didn't need to duplicate it. Oh, well. There we go. So now, now we can see the... Now we can see the writing. <laughs> Whoops! There's the writing. <laughs> the writing is on the floor. Let's go ahead and fix that really quickly. Thank you very much. Keyframes. Hello, keyframes. Nice to see you. Go away. <laughs> All right, go up to those keyframes, and we want to have those keyframes up here. At this point, so let's go ahead and bring those right below the floor. And then as the scene comes in, then the letters appear. All right, good. Good, 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 good. That's what we're looking for. I love Red 13. Yeah, have you guys ever played Final Fantasy 7? What is your favorite character? I honestly think Red 13 is mine. 
He is a cool character. He's a really cool character. Flaming Tail. Before. Flaming Tail. Bef was it that before Pokemon? I think it was before Pokemon, honestly. I can't recall. Ah. Hmm. I think I was more confused on the first playthrough. Um, so I saw that scene when I played through it, and I really didn't quite understand what was happening. I was just like, really? Wait a minute, they're, they're killing them off? And then, eventually, as I played through the game, I realized I wasn't getting her back. She wasn't coming back at all. So, it was kind of a, a slow build for me. It's just like, no, 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 they're gonna bring her back. I'm just like... And I, she's not coming back? What? So, it, I was kind of more in disbelief than anything. Okay, so we got the shaking the head. Nope, it's not gonna work. And then, let's actually, um, let's end, let's end uh, with this scene like so. All right, so that's how that scene is gonna end for Angel. We've got to get this dragon have a little bit more expression now, too, and a bit of movement. So let's do that. So how do we want the dragon to act? So we got our first initial little movement here. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. I think. I think we'll just have him move around and just kind of look in between the letters and the portal. I think that's what we're going to do. I don't think... Um, he's going to mime any talking yet. I think that's a little too early. So we're going to do this. Okay. Not too much. Okay, and then like so, and then we're going to come down a little bit quicker, I think, like this, and then, all right, and let's do a little bit back up again, and then rotate and then down. Let's grab this one and do a little bit of movement here. And then on the last section. There we go. 
There we go. I think that'll do. Okay. Now, I want the head to have a little bit more expression. Once it comes around... Let's bring this down a little bit. Hydrate! <laughs> I like how my little character over there is, um, uh, has the little lips moving perfectly when I did the... <laughs> Sometimes it's amazing what they can do with, um, just having a microphone being able to move the lips. 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 That is weird. Ah, e, u, a, o. All right, now I think he'll look down to the letters, I believe. Good. Okay, and let's do a little bit of continued movement. And then... Let's pause for just a second here and then come back up. To here. All right. All right, I think that'll do good. So that's the entire scene there. All right, I think I need a little bit more movement in the wings too, though. So let's just do some ambient movement with the wings then. Uh, this is local, but what is it doing? I don't think I've seen it. Okay. Okay. There we go. Just a little bit of movement there in the wings. All right, maybe a little bit more. That'll that's perfect. Let's move this like so. Maybe a l tad more. Yeah, that'll help out a lot. There we go. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 but yeah, an hour's worth of animation, just this one little scene right here. And that works out perfectly. Looks like it's not working. Okay. Mmm. Ah, that's right, that's right, that's right. I do have to change a couple things, though. And let's see here. This stuff needs to disappear. So on this scene, let's go ahead, keep the lettering there, make this disappear though. And now I want to put in some new lettering, I think. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and put in some text. Shift add text. There it is. Good, 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 good. Let's put in D 
DRA. Let's put in DRA and we are going to change this lettering to to what are you gonna change it to? Gotta change it to something. Uh, do I have it in the here? No, I do not. I'm gonna go grab the gal standard galactic alphabet is the one we're looking for. Galactic alphabet. This is the one we want. Good, 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 good. Actually, let's go ahead and do this. Rotate X 90 degrees. And we are just going to keep them as letters, I think. This should help me out a bit. So this, let's duplicate this thing and then bring it on up right here. Let's change the letter to an R. Duplicate this thing and bring it on over here and change this to an A. Okay, and I think I want to shrink these just a little bit. Individual origins, good. Good. Move these on over. So these ones need to disappear here. Good. So now as we come into the scene, we should see the change in letters. Good. Good, 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 good. And they shouldn't appear in any other way. Let's take a look at previous scenes really quickly. Oh, uh, good, doesn't show up, Ooh. good, doesn't show up, good, all right, and then in the other scenes, good, we are here, all right, now we can go into the next scene, next scene, <laughs> It's a dragon. Yes, it is a dragon. How you doing? Okay, now we can go into the next scene, which I think we can use the same camera for, to be honest. Let's see here. Alright, and then let's go ahead and move the camera. Uh, uh, how do we want to do this? What is our next scene? What is our next scene? Our next scene is going to be... Uh, hmm. Hmm. I think... I think I want him helping out with the farming. I think that's what I want to do. Or at least I think that is. And I'm not going to be able to use the same camera for that one. No. But I do need... I do need the... The black screen that's in front of it. That thing right there. There it is. Let's go ahead and take this guy. We are going to use this transition yet again. Transition is going to be a little bit faster. Let's go ahead and speed up the other transition, too. Okay. There we go. And then this one will transition into the next one. 
which needs to be the other camera. I think I'll, yeah, I think I'm gonna have him help out with the fields. Let's go to camera number two. Uh, do, 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 do. I think it's uh, control B. Okay. There we go, perfect. So we got the other camera up. Let's go ahead and use the same the same models here. Let's give these a little bit of a lock rock scale here for all their bones. And I want all of these bones to have a lock rock scale too, just before next scene. All of them need to be lock rock scale. Okay, good. And then this will probably have to go away. Let's do that really quickly. Put that away. And I need the dragon to now get into a position where it's helping out with the fields. Hmm. How do I want him helping out with the fields? The fields, the fields, the fields, the fields, the fields. I think... I think they're both going to be doing the same task, and the dragon is just going to be doing it better. I think that's how it's going to work. I think that's how it should work, yeah. They're both going to be trying to uh, plow the fields, and I think the dragon's just going to be able to do it better. And... Yeah, that way it doesn't look like uh, Angel is using him as labor. More or less, the dragon is kind of just showing off. Uh, Angel here lost his friends... Oh! His friends to the Nightmare Zone where they were fighting Jeff. But then the baby dragon hatches and Angel takes care of it. They find their way to save Angel's friends. Yep, that that is a good, quick explanation of it. Thank you, La Pengui. Thank you very much. Yep, that is a very good quick explanation of it. Let's go ahead and get in the background again and the farming building. There we go. Ooh. Alright, good, 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 good. Let's take this camera and let's put it into a position. All right. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is the right camera. Okay. I want you to be over in this field, maybe? Uh... Do... Do... Do 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 I feel like if I have the windmill in the in the shot, I have to have it turning like I did before for one of Impenskiz animations, and not sure if I want to do that. All right, so Angel's got to be plowing the fields. <laughs> Actually, no. No, I have something better. I have something better. <laughs> I have something far better, far better, I think. I think I'm going to have Angel harvesting the field. I think that's what I'm going to have him do. And that'll be easier on the animation, too. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to have Angel working on this area over here and the left-hand side, and then you're going to see the dragon come in here, come in from behind the building, jump, fly a little bit, and then jump, and then land into the wheat and kind of spin around and just harvest the entire field or where he lands. <laughs> 
So I think that's what's going to happen. I think that will be the best option for us. So I think... Um, I think... Yeah, we're going to have the dragon come on in, and then he's going to harvest the entire field. Um, oh, that's going to be a pretty long scene, though. Uh, I, don't, I don't have much time left. How much time do I have left? Uh, mm, how to shorten this up. How to shorten this up. Mm. I think... Okay, so it's got to be about this long right here. No, wait, not that long. It's got to be this long. It's almost got to be a pose, almost. It's got to be, like, almost just a single pose, almost. It can't be a... It can't be that much of, um, it's got to be implied that, uh, so I don't think I can have that, as cute as that is, and how much I want that to be in there, I can't actually have that in there. And this is one of the good things of why I don't write this stuff down, is because sometimes there, there isn't enough room, and I've got to cut some ideas out. So I've actually have to have almost like a still pose, just like this scene where it's, uh, how many frames is this? That's only 500 frames, something 500 frames that shows a lot of explanation. Because in this scene right here, it explains a lot. The dragon understands the lettering. The, uh, he's trying to help him fix the portal. It's not actually working right now. And... It's not ha it's not quite working yet. They're making some progress, but they're not there yet. Like in just 500 frames, that's all explained right there. Just like, is it working? The dragon understands it. No, it's not currently working. We're gonna give this another shot later. Um, I've gotta imply in this section here that the dragon is helping out with the fields, but I don't want it to look like Angel is using him as a type of uh, a type of mule, as it were. Something that kind of where they are just working together, but almost in like 500 frames. How do I show it in 500 frames? Um. Hmm. Like, if I have Angel plicking, uh, plucking wheat and giving it to the dragon, that almost feels like a type of mule activity. Hmm. That won't do where... I mean, it does in itself look cute, but I don't want it to look like he's just using him. Uh, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. What other farm activities are there that the dragon can help out with? That doesn't look like slave labor. Oh. Playful dragon popping up behind him with a mouthful of wheat and then spits it out into a container simultaneously. Pop. Bleh. <laughs> Could work. Mm. Yes! I got it. Okay. Yes, you're right. I think... I think if they are both harvesting wheat, the... And if the container is just... Um... Between them? Just uh, in between them, rather? I think that will work. I know that's not exactly what you were thinking of, but... It does help me move al things along. Yeah, if the container is in between them, and then they're both kind of a harvesting. So, yeah. All right, so now we need to get the wheat field separated from the ground. Because right now, the wheat field is connected to everything right now. And we don't need that. 
All right. Oh, wait. That's the wrong tab. All right. Oh, get ready for a lag fest. Tab. The final frontier. Do, 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 do. Okay, and I want wheat. Okay, actually, I don't want the edge. I want the facing side. Okay, facing side, wheat. Um, select. Good. Now we want to take all of this wheat and separate it by selection. All right, and then, good, now let's get out of that. Now we have less to work with. All right, let's put in a new collection here. We're gonna call this wheat. Uh, let's grab this one. So this is the wheat one. We wanna put that there. New, this one is going to be called Moving Wheat. This one's going to be called Moving Wheat. And anything that is going to be moving from scene to scene, like cutting out and coming back in, uh, that wheat is going to change. So now, what I want is, from this angle, I want this wheat... I want this wheat here. Okay, and I want that wheat there to go away. So I want this wheat to disappear. Uh, if I can hit Control L, does that do anything? Oh, good. So that fills out those. All right. Mm, not so much. We're going to have to change a few things here. Get rid of those and that one. Uh, uh, do, 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 do. Okay, those need to come in. All right, and these need to come in. I'm trying to select full sections of wheat rather than just uh, wow, this that's not happy. All right, let's go with that. Good. And these, let's take care of those. And that one. All right, I think, I think these are full blocks of wheat. Good. So let's take those and move them out by selection. Um... This goes into moving wheat. So this is a section of wheat that will disappear as soon as we come into this scene. So as soon as we come into this scene, here, I want lock rock scale. I want this to disappear. Oops, no, actually. Okay, do I have any keyframes for this? No, I do not. Object, set origin to geometry. Now let's do a lock rock scale. Okay, and as soon as we come into this range, the wheat will just utterly disappear. Okay. Grab, and we'll put you over here. So now when we come into the scene, there's a chunk of field that's missing over there. And I think we need to do the same for the other, for the dragon as well. Something where it signals that the dragon is instigating his own initiative and in participation. And just... 
Wait, what? Did you just... I think you did. What? What did I... What did I do this time? Wait a minute. Sorry. Yeah, I know. I'm a slowpoke. I am. I am a slowpoke. Slow polka. Ah. <laughs> Slow polka. Mm. Did I? Star Trek? Star Wars? Maybe. I, I intend to get those two theme songs confused for some reason. Sometimes uh, it just happens a lot. Um, okay, so we're going to have to take part part of this field here too. Let's go ahead and grab most of this. Okay, I think that does well. Yeah, that does well. Let's go ahead and do the same thing with that. Separate by selection. We're going to be moving you into moving wheat. Object set origin to geometry. Okay, good. There we go. <laughs> Stretch. How do I want to do this next section? Mm -hmm. I think I want to do this next section just in parts. Lee! What a way to announce your presence. <laughs> How you doing today, Lee? I am happy to have... Uh, ooh, where, 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 where are all my emos? Where's my all my emos? I have to go over here. Where's my... Don't worry. I'm not hungry today, Lee. 
I have some pizza. <laughs> I definitely have some, I still some pizza. <laughs> Uh, yep, I'm doing well. For sure. Just trying to make it through some of this rough area where I have to figure out how I want to proceed with this. And I'm thinking that I have to, um, let's actually, no, not do those. I have to do it fairly slowly wheat field by wheat field okay these six items I think are going to be angels selection okay so these ones are gonna be called angel wheat these ones are gonna be called angel wheat um, and next section over here I'm gonna have to big have big swashes of stuff taken out from the dragon dragon is going to take out this much in one go let's do that selection dragon that outfit wheat is not looking too hot right one. now you need something that looks prettier outfit, outfit change, change. Game show Z. <laughs> Puka, Puka, hey, hey, hey. You need a little bit more energy, like a caffeinated game show host. That's what you need. You need a you need a you need to have a little bit more energy. Get get on that cream sickle outfit and have a tie and get energized, okay? Alright. That sounds like a good enough plan. <gasps> You're agreeing with us? Like every once in a while you have something that doesn't, you know, involve stealing an outfit or, you know, insulting me in some way or tricking me in some way. Yeah, that's true. That's why we stole this outfit. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's grab game show. There we go. Put on that. And get ourselves out of the shush bush. The shush bush. Shush bush. Hydrate. <laughs> ah, almost out of one container. <laughs> Is that sheep looking at me? I can tell you one thing though, that there might be a puka looking at you. And now he's not. I want not, don't select that. I want this. Let's take out this swatch here too. The swatch of meat. Oh, meat? Swatch of meat? No, swatch of wheat. Wheat. Change my W to an M. So easy to do, isn't it? Change out those W's for M's. Only if you look at the world upside down. And then do a P. Selection. And then this one needs to be called Dragon Wheat 3. Dragon Wheat. I'd eat something called Dragon Wheat. <laughs> there we go. Dragon Wheat. There we go. And this Angel Wheat is going to have to be sectioned off a bit, too. I'm going to have to separate this block by block as well. Let's go ahead and do that. And that. P by selection. P by selection. <laughs> not not exactly. The the command the command the the quick command is P, and um, that just comes out way way too wrong. Way too wrong. It's just like letter P by selection. 
Right, yes. Let's not go into exactly jokes there. Should we or shouldn't we? <laughs> all right, and that should be all pre-automated lab labeling as angel wheat. Angel wheat and dragon wheat. <laughs> uh... Ah, all right. So now let's get our actors in position. Let's get our actors in position, though, shall we? We need these guys, and we've already pre-set up their their bone structures, so that way we can just drag them right on over. So the previous scene they'll be in one section, and in this scene they'll be in this section. There we go. Okay, and then let's bring them up so they're not inside the dirt. Dirt McGirt. Wait, what is that? What is, what is, what is that? What is that? What are you doing? No. Don't you dare try to mess this up. I swear I'll kill you. I, I selected all them bones, thank you. I selected all of them bones on this frame. And I hit lock, rock, scale. Okay, next frame. Thank you very much. Much better. It just tried to mess up everything I just made. Naughty blender. Naughty, naughty blender. Don't you dare mess up everything I just worked on. I saw that. You hid that from me. I saw it, though. Well, mods wish they, uh... Wish they are a puka remote with a pause... <laughs> pause before talking function. <laughs> I don't have that. I, don't, I really don't have that. And pause before talking. <laughs> She's like, should I say this? I'm just like, I don't know. Sometimes when you've done enough stupid things, you just don't don't think about what's stupid anymore. <laughs> uh, you really don't. Let's go with uh, uh let's go with the global here. Let's turn this. Whoa! I don't think that's gonna work right. Wow. Okay, hold on. Rotate dragon. Here we go. Okay. Dragon is here. Dragon is here. Alright. Good, 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 good. Let's get Angel in position too. Alright. Let's move on Angel over to here. Okay. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Oh, Mikey Plane. Hey. Enjoy your work like Mikey Plane. Nice to see you too. I'm glad to see you. Do do do. Let's see here. We need Angel to be in the other direction. Oh, let's see here. I want all of these except the main bone. Oh, how do we do? Zoom on right on over here. I think that will help a little bit. Yeah, I think this arrangement here would help over here. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's duplicate these keyframes, bring them right on over here. And right there. Grab, bring you right on over here. Good. Now, let's go ahead and move all of these bones, not by individual origins, but by median point. And give here 
Let's let's just reset all of you. Grab. Let's just reset all of it and bring you right on over here. There we go. And bring you on down. Not into the dirt. It's not quick dirt. It's not even quick sand. There we go. And this bucket needs to disappear. Bucket. Bucket needs to disappear. Need to disappear. Need to disappear. Um. Do do do. Do. Okay. So bucket is here. We will put the bucket on a lock rock scale there, and then make it disappear in this frame here. Shrink down. Police says to the size and in the hand. It's where we hide all of our all of our items. Disappeared. Plop. And then the bucket should be right there. Good. Good, good. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. We don't have a um Oh, we don't have a a lurk command, do we? I tried to get the lurk command for just sitting your and sitting your avatar down a little bit. Should have done that. Oh, by the way, mods, there is a little command. There is a little command that is a uh, new sub. New sub. So just uh, so that people know that they, if they have subscribed, they have the ability to. Have some subscriber only attire. Mm hmm. New little command. So that way people know what they can uh, get along with just little emotes. Let's get him. We need to get him a type of. Uh, a hoe kind of looks like a, a sickle, doesn't it? Or should I just make a sickle to begin with? Actually, I wonder if there's a sickle inside of the items. Um, let's get rid of the foreground really quickly and go into unused items. Items. Okay, let's get rid of the background and go into the unused items. Do, 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 do. Background. Is there a sickle that I can use? Oh, for goodness sakes. Hello? Hello, McFly! Hello! Hello. There we go. It's still stuck. There we go. I have no idea what was going on. There we go. Um, well, I knew that there was some sort of sickle inside of some of these extended items, but I think they're a little too epic for farming. Yeah. Um, hmm, because this one's kind of simple, but it's kind of super awesome, and I don't think that's what we're going for. I don't think we're going for super awesome sickle. We need something a little bit less out there. Uh, 
are for everyone. Hmm. Here's I'm wearing, uh, where am I remembering wrong? Oh, the fox ears for like, uh, the block men. Oh. Oh, okay. You are walking, wearing fox ears. Huh. Wait a minute. An avatar panel, there should be a section that is just called subscriber and they are unlocked. Huh. Okay. Well, I wasn't sure because I thought I w those fox ears were actually just a test thing for figuring out wh who I could uh, restrict from wearing certain objects. So I really didn't tell anybody about the fox ears. They might be subscriber only. Just because they were a test. I could put them... I could just move those fox ears into a uh, subscriber. Because I know how to attach them. But they would only be available for block men. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, I could do that. Hmm. Alright, so... I think... What I've got to do is, I think I'm going to try duplicating this guy here. And we're going to try editing this thing. So how do we have this? So this is, this is just um, a mesh. So it isn't an image that is being projected into a solid object. What, um, what MC Prep does... What MC Prep does is it takes uh, image files and turns them into a type of object. So if I put in place a puffer fish, it's not, it doesn't actually have this mesh. It's truly just a plane here. And all it has on is a solidify modifier and I can increase this solidifier. So it's just increasing its depth. Uh, just fake-like. So it doesn't actually have that. Let's go ahead and get rid of the pufferfish. But this guy actually has mesh, which might work to my advantage. Might work to my advantage, I'm not quite certain. It may work to my disadvantage, though. Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, ba -da -ba -da -ba. Let's try... Oh. Let's go to UV maps really quickly. And you have on diamond pickaxe. This is a diamond pickaxe? I'm sorry, that looks like a sickle to me. Uh, UV editing. All right, so this is the diamond pickaxe. Maybe we can take this thing and turn it into something else. I'm thinking we can do that. Let's open up Photoshop and try fiddling with this guy. Hey, Rebecca, how you doing? Do, 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 do. Opening up Photoshop. Shop. All right, and I want to find where that file is. Bring back up Blender for me. Where are you? Where are you? Um, create if necessary. Okay, well, that item is packed away with its object, but I did just create it into its new own little file, projects, journey, and textures. Okay, so what we can do is we can take this into Photoshop, Hoot ho, shop. There we go. 
And let's mess around with this. And let's actually turn this into an MC prep item. Um, I'm thinking, thinking we take off this little, little top portion here. This top portion needs to go away. Way away. How far away? Way away. Okay, let's get rid of that. And this portion here needs to go way away. Let's get rid of this. Mm, actually, I'm thinking, what if... Um, no. What if I did this instead? What if I just moved this section over? So I'm going to select just the blue portion of this. Just going to select the blue portion of this, and we're going to move this up to here. Shorten that down a little bit. I think that looks good. Hydrate! Grim, hello! Ah, water, nice, putting down the glass. <laughs> I saw that evil wink. That evil wink. <laughs> Bing bang. Bing bang. I know. <laughs> I've come to think that that bing bang is just a cheap version of trying to, uh, trying to surprise me or mentioning up the points. You know, I could have used the bit scare at that point. <laughs> I think that's what you guys are saying sometimes, or it's just like, you know, I could have, but I didn't. Don't worry, I spared you. Deselect. Um, <laughs> that's exactly what it is. <laughs> well, we could have. <laughs> uh, uh. All right, I think I need to get rid of this, a couple of these lumps here. I don't think these lumps are helping me much. Uh, uh. That selection is not is not cutting out what I want it to. It's kind of feathering some stuff here, and I don't think I like it. All right, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. All right, there we go. Get rid of some of these other lumps on here too. Good. Um, this middle section, how do we deal with you? You got a gem inside of you, and I don't like that. Mm. I'm just not feeling... Alright, that's fine. That's fine, but that's also what somebody says, uh, says to somebody right before they do the scare. <laughs> I'm just not feeling it tonight. Scare! Uh, Flaming Hot Cheetos were developed by a janitor at Frito-Lay. Oh, yeah, yeah. I heard about this. Yep. I heard about this. The guy took the, took the stuff home and made his own Cheetos and then presented it. And now he's a, uh, uh, now he's the CEO. Yeah. Or, um, assistant CEO or something like that. Heard about that. That's, this is a cool story. Um... Arctic Fox, there was something that I did want to ask you. You redeemed a, um, you redeemed a voice acting doohickey that didn't really have a voice acting thing inside of it. Did you actually want me to try a voice acting? Yeah, because I don't, because I looked at the request and I'm like, I don't see where you wanted me, what you wanted me to try. <laughs> uh, piece from Faust. I don't know what Faust is. Do not know what Faust is. I think. Um, how do we do this? 
I think I should put in some bands. Let's go to pencil. Um, no brush, and we want pencil. And we want the dropper, and let's take this. Okay, I think... I think we just cover this up, pretty much, kind of. All right, like so, and then I think I'm gonna take another different color of this, that one. I think I'm gonna take that one. All right, and then like so, I think I'm just going to kind of give it a band on top of it. Do 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 do. And get rid of this. All right, that works out better. Yeah, I think that works out lots better. Now let's go ahead and colorify this into something different. So we need to change this into a different color, but I want to only color this portion. I think the the blue of this blade helps it, but I don't like quite like the color of what it is. So let's go ahead and do a image adjustments, hue and saturation. I want to change it to a type of brown. All right, turn up the saturation a bit and turn down the lightness. Green, brown. I want it to be a brown, which is basically a dark red. I think that's gonna be about as brown as I can get it, and we're gonna darken it down a bit. Uh, actually, no, right there is okay. Down in the valley, um, a book about a scientist that is between, uh, down in the valley, there were three farms. <laughs> All right, sound alert, burp. Thank you for the 10 biddies. Down in the valley, there were three farms. The owner of these farms had done well. They were rich men. They were also nasty men. All three of them were about as nasty and mean as men you could get could meet. Their names were Farmer Bogus, Farmer Bounce, and Farmer Bean. Bogus was a chicken farmer. He kept thousands of chickens. He was enormously fat. This was because he ate three boiled chickens smoothed with, smothered with dumplings every day for breakfast, lunch, and supper. Bounce was a duck and a goose farmer. This has been a fantastic Mr. Frog. Oh, okay. I haven't watched the movie. I should. I have it. A, I have the ability to. All right. So I think that is a pretty good sickle. I think that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. There we go. All right. File. We are going to save you as. Um. I think that's what it is. I think that's how you pronounce it, or spell it. Anyways. There you go, Papa. I need to go back into Blender now. And I think what I can do is... That outfit is not looking too hot right now. You need something that looks prettier. Bonus. Outfit change! <laughs> Bounce poker. But buns? Buns as like buns. Oh. Buns. 
bounce. Well, he's fat. Well, they, they described him as fat. Like, enormously fat. It could be called bounce. Right? But doom. <laughs> hey, I heard this great joke. I heard this great joke. Great joke. Uh, two drums and a cymbal fall off a cliff. So on to the uh, outfit change over here. Let's go ahead and take a look. What is it? I need some stylish glasses and earrings, I think. Oh, just some stylish glasses and earrings? I think that looks good. Puka, puka, hey, 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 hey. I think we want to take inspiration from, uh, um, we want to take inspiration from, uh, Are you guys all right? <laughs> What what is wrong with what is wrong with you guys? <laughs> I think you guys need to go lay down. Go ahead. <laughs> Here, I'm just gonna do the outfit change of my own. I have no idea what's up with the pretty horses. What what is even going on? <laughs> 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 Possibly. Well, no, no, they didn't. They didn't. They didn't finally go insane. They've already been bad. <laughs> yeah, they they might have grim. I think that might be the problem. They just need to be off the job for a current moment. They just need to not come back for a little while until they sober up. Right? Can't be on the job and drink at the same time. That's called against company policy. Um. That one. There we go. Glasses and an earring. I think it looks good on me. <laughs> We're not insane yet. <laughs> now the pretty horses are definitely insane. Definitely insane. No two factors about it. it is definitely insane. Okay. Let's go to layout. Let's try using MC Prep and see where we go with this. Alright, and I want uh, MC Prep advanced. I want you to... Oh, item, but I want you... Item from file, here we go. Item from file, textures. Let's see if it can bring in this big of an item. Yes, it can. Ah, look at this. This is one reason why I like MC Prep. Take a look at this. It took that file that we just made, and instead of messing around with the mesh over there, trying to make the uh, texture fit, it just made this guy, and now it's... Instead of having a transparent layer, having to cut out everything that's transparent, just did it all for me. Three, two, one, pretty easy. Because now we got ourselves a zigle. Zigle. Um, let's go ahead and put this into his hands. Let's put this into our angel's hands over here. I'll put it right over here. Just right here. Um, I need it to apply to this bone. This bone right there. That bone. Let's give it a little P. Bone relative. Okay, good. And now I need this sickle to appear when I want it to, and not any other time. So let's go ahead and shrink this guy down and place him right inside of the hand. There we go. Now we go into the next hey, scene. Puka, puka, puka. Psst, 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 psst. My is trying to get your attention. Oh, I am gone. Sorry. I'm sorry. Horses, they're insistent. All right, let's fix that, shall we? <laughs> there we go. Much better. All right, I'm back. 
you a pic and the scene from the movie in the DM for later. Oh, okay. Invisible go again. Yep. <laughs> I love that mod poke. I am I am happy the way that that animation turned out for mod poke. Absolutely love it. I love it. Cuz the the way that the the way that they're animated is just awesome. Mod poke. I just love this. Hey, hey. Puka. 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 trying to get your attention. Puka. 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 I need to get some more animations for like the the subscriber one, and um... oh gosh! Boop. <laughs> Boop snoot. Love that one. That one's fun. <laughs> uh, or oh, wait, wait. Luca Strider. Is that the one? No. I have no idea what what is that one called? I forget not what that one's called. Trigger fire. Do 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 do. Go ahead and trigger fire really quickly. Videos. Um oh. Oh that's right. Ah, it's not a command. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to make it a command. I forgot to make that one a command. <laughs> uh, Puka Strider is not a command. That one's only, um... Oh, goodness. How many... How many is Puka Strider? I forget... I forget what Puka Strider's uh, bits were. What is... What is the bits for Puka Strider? I've already forgotten. Oh, well. I guess I'll have to look that up later. Isn't it 66? Is it? I'm gonna have to look that up later. I have completely forgot. Completely forgot. Alright, so we want Angel to be harvesting some wheat here. We'll figure out the dragon later. Oh, it is! Yay! Thank you, Graham, for testing that out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a strange one. That is a strange one. You know what? I actually shouldn't have that just yet. Let's not get Angel yet. We still need to have the container and when he's going to be a... Uh, um... <laughs> uh... We still need the container that they're both going to be tossing stuff into. So I think I should get a barrel in here. Um, barrel, barrel, barrel. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's go over to the blocks, unused items, Minecraft pallet. Ow! Hit me. <laughs> it's just hit me. He just hit me. Did you just hit me? You just hit me. <laughs> you know, you could also say that you bit me. <laughs> uh, where is the blocks at? Right here. Here they are. I need to look for the barrel. Bar ah, there's the barrel. Found it. Found it! Don't worry, I got it. I got it. Right. It's right there. It's right there, yo. Yo, yo, it's right there. It's right there. And duplicate. 
and I want you to move on over to shift shift s Kurt uh, selection the cursor boink and I want to move you on over to land background wheat I'm gonna move you over to that zoop there we go rotate X whoops no rotate x 90 degrees nope negative 90 degrees there we go actually um grab z 0.5 there we go now it's sitting directly on the ground how do we open up the lid of this thing do 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 ba 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 I think I should go to textures no 3D rendering textures Minecraft skins game textures block and I want the barrel oh the barrel's right here at the top Barrel open. Open image. There we go. I want an open barrel. Open barrel. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Watch out. Grim's, Grim's a biter. Do, 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 do. Uh, let's see here. I want to put in rude. <laughs> well, you, it's true. You bit me. You bit me. <laughs> uh, so are my... So I'm trying to teach one of my puppies to not bite me when I give it uh, some uh, when I give it some treats. Bang. <laughs> uh, that teddy bear isn't cuddly anymore. <laughs> uh, let's get some wheat in here. I think. Bing bang. Bing bang. <laughs> you do I want wheat wheat right here let's place in some wheat there we go do 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 ah you fool gah ha <laughs> Thank you for the 50 biddies. <laughs> uh, well, welcome to the awake world, E. <laughs> uh, and saw that the timer timer go down, and I was ready. <laughs> It was a delayed shot. In the shot. It's how snipers like to do that. Delay. Just wait. Ah, delayed shot. Hmm. Don't run away from a sniper. You only die tired. <laughs> hey, Toastmaster. Is that Gerard? No, okay. I thought that was... uh somebody else never mind that uh liquid liquid bits hmm i thought that was uh somebody else <laughs> no uh no the the emote there the emote i thought that was uh gerard from um the completionist 
I thought, and because of the beard, I thought that was him. <laughs> okay. Uh, the Completionist. I, I watched uh, The Completionist a lot for quite some time. Um, I got to finally... I, I got into watching them after watching, uh, watching their playthrough of Mother 3. And that... Uh, it brought me a lot of joy to finally see that game in its entirety and uh that's that's one game i've been waiting for for the longest time if anybody played earthbound is to see mother three was was a real joy and i'm really glad that he did the playthrough of that There we go. Got some wheat in a barrel. Wheat in the barrel. There we go. Hmm. That's one time. In case well played. Still, I can just uh, go into my... <laughs> uh. mm, speaking of Earthbound, that's apparently what the uh, the track is coming up to. One of the Earthbound songs remixed. In Dreaming on Distant Shores. Alright, now I think I can add some animation to these guys. Because now I know where I'm tossing the wheat. Yeah, uh, thank you very much, Nightbot. Had to, had to double check, make sure. You know, sometimes you forget. Don't worry, we're all good. Both in real life and in my avatar. <laughs> uh, normally they're a requirement for the outside world. In this COVID-19 age, you know... Uh, Sometimes people forget that they exist. You know? It's it's required for the outside world. Very much required. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
Actually, probably the easier way to do this is if... Is if I turn this upper torso a bit. Yeah, I think the easier way is to turn the upper torso. There we go. I'm not liking how that works. Let's change something up about this. Let's put the origins point somewhere else. But I already have keyframes put in. I think I'm just going to have to change it. Shift S, let's put the cursor where the selection is, and I want to take, um, let's do this. Object, set origin to 3D cursor, cursor, okay. And this thing, I want this lock rock scale where it is, all right. But this next frame here, it's gonna have it Sticking out. Let's change that up a bit. Good. Let's change up this. Because the origin point changes. Ah, uh, actually it probably changes for the better. Uh, we're still good. We're still good. Good. Now I can... Bring this sickle and move it in the positions that I want without... Changing the point, all I have to do is rotate it a bit. So let's go ahead and rotate it. There we go. Now that the origin point pivots on this, it helps out quite a bit. Like that. Okay, good. Yeah, now, now, now as I bring back the sickle, it should rotate into the correct position for swinging it, which is nice. There we go. Um, there we go. Come on, lay down. Lay down, lay down, lay down, lay down. Stop digging at the bed. There we go. Much better. Uh, let's put it in between the two hands here. Oh, good. It can it can reach both hands. Good. Do 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 ba do 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 do. Good, 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 good. Now let's see if we can do the first swing here. And... Let's go for this little block right here. I'm gonna bring the arms over here. Okay, and then we need to have the body follow along with. Okay, something's wrong with this arm right here. I want this elbow to be there. I also want this hand to be here. Okay, good. And then this guy needs to face this direction. Okay, good. So now, 
Whoop. Okay, what are you doing? What, 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 what? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Oh, that's what happened. That's what happened. I know what happened. There we go. Much better. Okay, gotta fix these in-between frames, too. Let's do that. Gotta fix this in-between elbow as well. There we go. Perfect. So now it should swing a little bit more proper. A little bit more proper. Still, ha still having some problems here. First time using a sickle. Come on. There we go. There we go. Now we have good follow-through. And speaking of follow-through, that is what we need to do with these hands here. We need to continue on with our movement like this and our upper body. So let's go ahead and keep on rotating. Just have a cool down period for, for the swing. Boom. Yeah, see? Instead of an immediate stop, it has a little bit of a cool down, which is nice. And then we can have even more cool down here here even more so now foom. there we go like that like that for sure good 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 now all right and we still have about oh how much time do we have oh yeah 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 we get we got plenty of time plenty of time we can take this all the way up to point number uh, 8,500 frame, frame 850, uh, 8,500, frame 8,500, because that will be a good quick section. All right, um, I do want to get rid of those Minecraft items over there and Minecraft palette. Let's get rid of those. Good. Sunk. Good, 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 good. Okay, so now that he's swung at that one, we can actually take down the wheat that he swung at. And let's go ahead and put in that. Then the next frame, it's gonna go down. Oh, 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 crud. All right, is there any keyframe for any of these? Good. Um, we're going to have to reset all of the origin points on all of this. Okay, all of those need to have reset origin points. Set origin point to geometry. There we go. Okay, so now since we don't have a keyframe, nothing funky is going to happen. Okay, now let's go ahead and take this down a couple blocks. Okiska. Okiska. Battle Royale! <laughs> Isn't it nice where you can just put in the command right in, in the... Uh, and the point request, and it works. Ow. Ow. I'm just getting... I'm just getting teamed up on in the corner. Oh, I am so dead. <laughs> I am so dead. I am definitely not winning that round. That's for sure. I just realized that, uh... That Rebecca looks like B Zuma. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, or just a B. I mean, I've been working with uh, Zuma Void's recap videos for a long time. 
that it's just like, oh, that looks like B-Zuma. And it's just like, you know what looked like B-Zuma before, before his B-Zuma? Bees. <laughs> and speaking of, Rebecca won. <laughs> Okay, now just as soon as it pops away, we need to get some wheat in there. That will... All right, let's grab this wheat here. Duplicate you. Bring you right on over here. Excuse me. There we go. Okay, and then right into the bucket we go, or barrel, I'm sorry. There we go, and then, punk. there we go. Punk. <laughs> Perfect. Duke. I like that. That's that does good. Thank you, Toastmaster. Harvesting some wheat. Mm. You know, I just now realized that har that plowing the fields, um, the way I was going to go with it, wouldn't be very Minecraft-like. Like, like uh, the way to plow the fields is with a hoe inside of Minecraft, but if you were doing it uh, by yourself without any um, horses, you'd use a, a push, uh, a push wedge in order to uh, plow the fields. And I'm like, that's not how you plow the fields in Minecraft. That's not how that works. And I'm like, oh, we'll just skip that part then. Because I was at one point thinking that uh, Angel could be trying to use one of those push wedges in order to plow the fields. And then the dragon would just come along and just go zipping right by. But I'm like, eh, that's, that's, that's not very Minecraft-like now, is it? But we got a little bit more Minecraft-like with a, with a sickle here. And let's do that same little action. See if we can do that. Um, I want to take all of this. Let's duplicate it. Uh, actually, I'm sorry. No. Let's take all of that action. Thank you very much. And um, let's put in a lock rock scale for that. Now let's duplicate this and bring it all over here. All right, and then I think at that point right here, this guy, come on, give me the sickle. There it is. I think this guy is going to have to be like there. And there we go. And let's time that up with this. Da, da, da. Scythe. Or is it a scythe? What is it? I've been calling it a sickle. Is it a scythe? I'm not, I'm not sure exactly what that term is for this device. <laughs> All right, so now what I can do is I can take 
this one, one of these other ones here, and make that guy disappear. So now on this run through, pop that one, and then. It would be a sickle if it's one handed, I think. Also, bringing back my old Minecraft memories with that pickaxe you're using as a scythe. Haven't seen Doku craft in a long time. Yes, right. I haven't. I haven't seen that in forever since um, my wife was using it. Because I know that and she liked that um, texture pack. I think it's a texture. It's a texture pack, right? It's been forever. Let's see here. Resource pack now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Tells you the age of me, though. It's just like, it's a texture pack. What's a texture pack, Grandma? Why would somebody kid be calling me Grandma, though? <laughs> uh, words I can't English well. I can't English words. All right, let's grab that that wheat that flew over there. Mm, this thing right there. Give me that. I want that. And let's do that with the next one. All right. And then let's do a lock rock scale on that and then duplicate it here. Okay, so now it goes doom, 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 doom. But I want it to start from here instead. Plunk. So now, now this one goes plunk. And then this one goes plunk. There we go. Not that you can really see the difference between the two flying. But that's not a problem. That's not really a problem. <laughs> 11th year in Minecraft. When did... I think my wife got me into Minecraft when we were at our first apartment. I think. When, when me and my wife got married, we moved into a cheap apartment, okay? And I think... I think that's when she got me into Minecraft. Oh my gosh. Okay, so uh, you've actually probably been playing Minecraft longer than me, because I think I think um yeah because yeah, uh, let's see here we've been married ten years coming up soon, so yeah you've been playing Minecraft probably longer than me. Yeah. Yeah. You've been playing Minecraft longer than longer than me. I've been only playing ten years. You've been playing eleven. <laughs> you know how she got me into Minecraft. She's just like, hey, um, Puka, and yes, she does call me Puka in real life. So just imagine that. My wife says, Puka, can you do me a favor? Can you? Take my character and uh, just um, start mo uh, taking down these trees during nighttime, because I can't handle the monsters. I'm like, sure, I can handle the monsters. <laughs> so she got me into Minecraft because I enjoyed gathering resources and staying alive uh, inside of a forest. And then um, she said I needed my new my own account. Because I kept on taking her character and moving her over to a place that I was building my own stuff with. And she's just like, okay, I don't want to keep on logging on and finding my own character in your base. You need your own account. <laughs> so, uh, and at that point, I didn't realize that there was any other food other than rotten flesh. So I would constantly go over to somebody's... Um, 
zombie farm and pick up rotten flesh thinking that this was the only thing that I could eat. And it's just like, there's other food? Like bread? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Mm, oh, I can take down uh, Photoshop now. There we go. Get rid of Photoshop. That doesn't need to be up. Uh, having Photoshop up, does that delay the stream? Oh, okay, no. It does not delay the stream. We're good. Okay, and I think... I think I can get away with one more swing. Uh, uh, let's see here. How does this progress? Actually, let's see this from the previous scene. Alright, let's see these scenes back to back. So... Okay, actually, yeah, I think one more swing would do it. It's just fine. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's duplicate this. And... Okay, we're going to start all of the points from right here. Uh... No. I think we're going to have to move this... Move him just a little bit. Okay, let's do this for the first initial... initial movement here. Okay, right about there. Is that okay? No, no, no. We're gonna have to go even further. And move this guy on back. Way back. Okay. Oh, I did just notice something, though. Okay, so now we can put all of the other items on this frame here. We're going to have to fix some other things with this, but that won't matter too much. Okay, so this guy needs to appear again. Where is it? There it is. Do, 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 All right, and this one will appear from right here. Good, and then fly into the there. Sweet. Okay. Brothers and my cousins, I was known as the Iron King due to my mass mines and ready supply of it. They may have had diamonds, but they had to buy buy their iron from me. <laughs> B brain, hi, how you doing, B brain? Hello. You know. Have we done any shoutouts for uh, for Lee, Grim, or B Brain at all? You should do some shoutouts for those those guys. Mods, could you please? <laughs> shout out! Shout out! Oh my gosh! Guys, gotta check out Lee. He's got tons of cool pizza. You know, that's wait. He doesn't he doesn't bake pizza. 
Hi, what do you mean he doesn't? Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, B Brain, for the subscription. I appreciate that very much. Hugs to you very much. <laughs> Hug at B Brain. Hug. <laughs> I'm wondering if I should make an animation where my character... You know... Come to think of it, I could probably do something with my avatar doing a hug. Oh, I could! I could do something with my avatar doing a hug, because I think I can have that animation. Sorry, I just keep on going on these little tangents here, but... I think I can do this. Let's see here. I need... Um, oh, what is that... Uh, Adobe Animation. What is that called? I forget what it's called. Maximo. That's what it is. This thing. Um. Just, uh. All right, just hold on. Let me log in. Log in. Do, do, do. With a uh, giggle. Ba -da, ba -ba -da -da. There we go. This thing right here. This thing. Um, I'm able to download these animations and apply them to my avatar over here, and they can brought be brought up on command. But for some reason, I can only download these animations and then apply it. I can't make my own for some reason. I don't know why. But I am so glad I found this because all of these animations are completely free. You don't even need to have an account with Adobe. Well, I think you might need to have an account, but you don't need to have a paid account or something with Adobe. But they're all completely free. And I just take those and I turn them into... um Turn them into animations for the avatar. Really cool thing. Yeah, un unfortunately though, I just I just now remembered this. Um, these animations only apply to the upper torso. So, so there's the um, there's this one here. That um, let's see here. Choose a motion. Oh, I don't have... Oh, I don't have motions enabled right now. Whoops. <laughs> uh, Whoops-a-daisy. Yeah, this these animations only apply to the, to, to the upper torso. I wish I could apply it to the lower torso, though. Where the, the legs and everything, but it doesn't work. Oh, well, eventually. Eventually have something better down the line. Yeah. Puka, are you... You are a... Tangent. <laughs> After Effects? No, I've never played with After Effects. Ever. I can't say that I've ever used After Effects. But I do have the program. Um... Like, uh, I do have a paid subscription with Adobe so that my wife can use most of it, but honestly, I've... Not used much of the um, much of the uh, the Adobe products that are paid for, to be honest. Most of what I do for animations and pretty much everything else has been for free programming. Is yeah, it's just been free. I mean, down to Blender. It's all free. Everybody can do this. Ooh. Ooh, something's shiny, and I'm not a fox, I'm actually a squirrel. And here here comes a random tangent. Our normal stream will resume in a few. <laughs> when did that come up? <laughs> uh 
I, I, when did that, th that command? And it's just like, wait. <laughs> uh, I'm not a fox. I'm actually a squirrel. I'm, I am currently a squirrel. Currently a squirrel. Okay. <laughs> All right, so that's good there, and I think we're going to fade out from this transition here. So let's go ahead and quickly do that. Duplicate, we're going to put that right there. All right, and then actually grab... All right, and I think next session... Okay. I don't know what the next session is going to be, but we're going to put a lock rock scale on this camera, and we are going to take a point right there. Don't know what the next section is going to be. Okay, so I think, other than the facial expressions, I think Angel is pretty much done. Pretty much done. There are some little bits of animation here that I need to fix. Like, let's grab... Like, right here. That needs to be fixed. For sure. Okay, good. And then, I think it does the same thing here, almost. Alright, there we go. All right, those elbows definitely need to change too, though. Let's zoom in on that elbow really quickly. Do do. Yeah, that's not gonna do well. There. Need that other elbow. There it is. That's what I saw before. What are you doing, elbow? What are you doing? There we go. Much better. Much, much better. Mm, give it a little saver uni there. The only thing I like about nobody is how easy it is to make a brush in Photoshop. Yes, it is very easy. My son John was tall and slim and he'd a leg for every limb. But now he's got no legs at all for he ran a race with the cannonball Timmy Rudunda. Fad riddle the whack for the riddle Timmy Rudundee. <laughs> is that? <sighs> tall and slim and he'd... Now that he's got no legs at all, he ran a race with a cannonball. Timmy, mm, Timmy Rudunda, what? <laughs> what? What? Now that he has no legs, he's in a race with a cannonball. Is uh huh. <laughs> Please tell me that's that's a um, that's a song or something, or a poem. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. Okay. Alright, so this point right here, I'm going to give this a lock rock scale to all the bones. Good. <sighs> hmm. It's a song. Yeah, it's a it's a shanty. Ah. Uh, line. Left two. Find legs behind. Zoom. Two fine legs. 
<laughs> sea shanties. Sea shanties are... Mm, sea shanties have become quite popular lately. Probably because of just that one dude that definitely has the right accent for a, uh, a sea shanty. Right accent for it. And I saw an interview on like mm, Good Morning America where I just I just wanted to see I just wanted to hear his normal accent day-to-day -day accent and it was a beautiful accent really beautiful accent I loved it hmm or the Wellerman yes Wellerman Soon may the Wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when her tagging is done, uh, we we'll take our leave and go. Soon may the Wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. Like, the only sea shanty that I knew before then was Drunken Sailor. Hmm. And the Flying Dutchman. <laughs> the Flying Dutchman is an actual sea shanty? Really? The Flying Dutchman is an is a real sea shanty. Oh, is is that why is that why they gave it the name in Pirates of the Caribbean? The Flying Dutchman? Bring a sugar and tea and um, one day when our tuggin is gone, I'll take our leave and go. Is a Wellerman isn't a shanty. What? What? Well, I know there's two different types of shanties. One's f one's for uh, heaving, and one's for um, pushing. Uh, when to in order to do uh, depending on what type of task they were doing, not not for pulling pushing, but um, for like uh, one for timing and the other one for like a. Uh, cranking thingies. I'm sorry, the only knowledge that I have of this is YouTube. <laughs> I haven't actually researched this. <laughs> but I think that's what it is, right? Uh, it has no call and response, therefore it is not a shanty. It is a f folksle song? It's a folksle song? Which is a song... Uh, sung by the crew, which is a song sung by the crew during the off hours during relaxation. Ah, okay. Alright, so now we need the dragon to do something. Oh my gosh! Look at the time, guys. Holy cow. Cows. Yo. Cows, yo. I completely forgot. I need to put something in here. I need to put in some chickens or something. Hold on. Uh, not only did I re not realize what time it was, but I should probably put in some like other animals here or something. Let's put in a mob really quickly, just a chicken. Chicken! Spawn chicken. Yay, we have chicken. Okay, done. We have another mob in here. <laughs> Zoop. There we go. Check it. Mm. Ah I hate this. I hate these subsurf modifiers. They just need to go away. Nobody wants them. Go away. No, no. To, just say no to subsurf modifiers. When you're working with Minecraft. 
You don't need that much detail. You do not need that much detail. Go away. Go away. There we go. Simple character rigs. Just need a few pixels to bend. That's all. You don't need too much. No subsurfing here. Just a few pixels. Perfect. That's what we want. Folksel is actually a shortening of the word for castle. Uh oh. Um, guys? Uh oh. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Um. Uh. Guys, we might have to end early like really badly something has gone bad like really bad on my second monitor um i gotta bring this over here oh boy everything has gone super bad on my other monitor like really bad oh boy <laughs> oh my god i think my monitor is dying oh wow uh yeah, let's go ahead and, um, yeah, I can't see a dang thing. Let's go ahead. We gotta, we got to do thing now. We have to do things. Oof. Um, we're gonna fi figure out if we can raid somebody really quickly here. Do, 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 do. Yeah, my monitor, I think my monitor is dying. It just, bam, dead. Oof. Um, let's go ahead and see if we can go into, I guess, um, uh, is, normally we go into Jen today, um, should we go into Jen then? I think she's up, I don't know, let's take a look, Twitch, she, she's on today, since it's Tuesday we normally go into Jen, since it's Tuesday, she we go into Jen. is not up. Uh, we got Big Chili Chill. Um, we got Antonio Ash. We got Stress Monster and Doc M. Um, so one of those uh, three. Oh, is Angel up? I think is is Angel up? Yeah, Angel is live. Because I kind of rely on my problem to go these guys behind me. Alright, uh, let's mute him really quickly. So, should we go over to... yeah. Let's go over to Angel. Oh, Jen just went live. Ah, okay. Alright, we'll do that. Stick with our normal. Okay. We will do that then. Raid. Da, 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 da. Jen. All right. Well, I'm glad my monitor decided to to um stop working now rather than you know like half an hour ago. Well, it just decided to like, oh, okay, we'll just do that. I'm, I'm going to post a picture of this. Like, I have no idea, because I don't think I can screen cap that. That, that is crazy. <laughs> Dead monitor. Um, yeah, I just probably need to get a whole new monitor. Oh, well. All right, see you guys later. Um, take care. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the subscribe and for the subscriptions and the biddies. Appreciate you guys. And you've helped me get through another section of this animation. It is very appreciated on what you guys do to help uh, get me through this. 
it is a long journey that this animation is going to be long journey. Take care. Bye.